The most common problem I see around cooking is people not understanding that it's the temperature of the food, not the environment that matters. And by gathering some data, we're gonna see exactly what happens at different points with chocolate chip cookies. I'm gonna put a lump of the cookie dough on the sheet here and stick a probe thermometer in it. It tells you internal temperature of things. And this guy's an infrared thermometer. It tells you surface temperature of things. Best geek toy ever. Once you put that chocolate chip cookie dough into the oven, the cookie dough starts to get hotter, of course. But it's not like it just gets hotter in one linear, continuous curve. It actually goes through a couple of really important discrete physical and chemical changes. First one's around 92 degrees Fahrenheit, when the butter starts to actually melt. Then around 212, all the water that's present from that butter begins to steam out and set the outside of that cookie. Around 310 degrees, the cookie starts to turn light brown. We want to actually have this nice brown toasted outside, in which case you have to make sure your oven's at least above 356 where that caramelization of sucrose begins to happen. 